I uh, I was in the hospital for, I guess, from what they said it was UTI, and but I didn't know when I got sick because I was almost unresponsive. But anyway, um, it, I ended up with sepsis, and so that was the cause of the loss of the fingers, which led to the loss of the hand. I didn't really know about it until a, like a few weeks before the hand surgeon in Jackson said he was going to do a partial amputation because of the necrosis in my fingers. And so he did that and then did th I did therapy with it and then after that um, I was referred by his office to the orthotics and uh, the orthotics and prosthetics clinic in from Michigan Medicine and they referred me to Dr. Sederna, well to another doctor, Dr. Chung, and then eventually to Dr. Sederna, who did the complete amputation. And then like a year later, he asked me about the, um, about doing the research and I was, I thought it was interesting and, and I thought I could um, help out in making these robotic hands work better for other amputees. Yeah, it makes you feel good because I've learned a lot and I'm happy to put myself in this position to where I can help other people, not just me helping them, but in this process help them. Well, the, uh, I had electrodes implanted into my muscles in my, form, in my uh, residual limb and it had wires that came up through the bicep and they're on um, connectors. And then when I go into the lab, they connect me to their computer and then they put a, like a grounding wire connection on so that it reduces the noise. And then they put the sleeve on like a, um, some kind of type of sleeve on and then they put the, uh, the socket over that and then they attach the hand to the socket. And all the signals from the muscles comes up through the wires into their computer and then they read it on their screen. But I can pick up a cup, I can actually operate a Keurig coffee maker and a lot of and, uh, other, and some other things like I was actually able to type on a laptop in there one day, and at one and one, at once I even uh, used uh, played on a key played a, a, a small song on a keyboard, a musical keyboard. Yeah, yeah, yes. I'm I've been doing it for like three and a half years now, and they told me I can do it for as long as I wanted to continue to be involved in it. And as of right now, I'm. I'm happy to help out as long as I can.